The Father Duenas Friars finished their 2015 IFL football season undefeated, capping off a perfect season behind their 27-8 win over the George Washington Geckos. FD's running game proved to be the difference maker as their offensive line was able to create big holes for the ground game. Jake Benito scored the game's first touchdown, while teammate Devin Sudo pulled in a touchdown pass from quarterback Daniel Phillips right before the half. Jake Benito put the Friars up 20-0 behind this big run for a score. Sophomore running back DeAndre Cruz punched in the last score for FD from a couple of yards out to seal the win. GW would get into the end zone late in the game when Jacob Frias pulled down an 11-yard pass. As time winded down in the contest, FD was crowned champions with the 27-8 win. We're really humbled as a team to bring it back. It's been 07 since uh, Coach Ivan Schroma when we won our last championship. So it's a real humble experience that uh, our boys worked hard all year for this championship. So, you know, it's a good win. And all the, all the other teams played really great. Great job. Uh, GW did a good job. Uh, they got a great team, great program. So it, was, it wasn't an easy uh, season, but it was a well fought. This year, we really wanted to work hard. Last year, we were... We, came, we, we lost here and it inspired us and it motivated us to come out. And we've been working so hard and all of us seniors, the juniors, sophomores and freshmen, we all wanted this championship so bad. This is just one of the goals and glad to achieve it. I'm glad to be a Friars and I'm glad I play with all these boys. The Guam Visitors Bureau welcomes IT&E as a major telecommunications sponsor of the 2015 Coco Weekend which includes the ninth annual Guam Coco Kids Fun Run on Saturday, November 7th, followed by the 10th annual Guam Coco Half Marathon and Ekin Relay on Sunday, November 8th, held at the Governor Joseph Flores Memorial Park down in Tumon. GVB has received $10,000 in support from it &E during a recent check presentation at it &E's corporate office in the Harmon Industrial Park. Keeping with some running news, the Guam Community College Foundation, First Hawaiian Bank, and the students of GCC's Supervision and Management Personnel Supervision classes will host the third annual John K. Lee Jr. Scholarship Fund 5K Run Walk on Saturday, November 7th at the Chamorro Village in Aganyam. Early registration fee is $7 per person and $5 for students. Group rates are available. Race day registration is $10 per person. Proceeds will actually go towards scholarships for GCC students. Uh, John K. Lee Jr. served on the board of, of directors for GCC for um, over 20 years and he was a big advocate of education and philanthropist. So um, First Hawaiian Bank actually uh, donated $25,000 a few years ago to start this scholarship. So every year, uh, this is the third year for the 5K, try to raise more proceeds to go towards more scholarships. We actually have a lot of, a few other activities going on. There's going to be face painting and balloon art for the kids. Uh, we incorporated the 2K to get more families to come out. Uh, we understand that Coco is the next day, but this would be a good last minute uh, training opportunity for those runners. Um, we are also giving away a, a trip on United Airlines to uh, anywhere in Asia, Micronesia, or the Philippines. So there will also be a lot of good prizes from our sponsors.